In this video, we will see how we can quickly size an exchanger inside the HiSys environment. For this lesson, we will utilize our TEG dehydration simulation. In order to size a heat exchanger, double click on it and then select the size exchanger option. So it is on auto size. Now click on convert button here. So it will automatically size the best exchanger for you. EDR regress calculation will set outlet stream conditions. Do you wish to overread existing outlet stream specification to avoid over specification? Click on yes. Then you can see it is solved. If you move to the regress shell and tube option, so you will find the profile here, the tube layout, the settling plan detail, the result summary. If you move to property ranges, so you can modify the property there. And if you move to the process, so you can adjust the process condition according to your need. And if you go to Exchanger, it will tell you about the TMA type, the tubes, geometry, and the shell geometry. And in the application option, you will find that the hot fluid allocation is tube, calculation method is advanced method, the condenser type and the vaporizer type is set default. The calculation mode is simulation, but if you want to find the falling, so you can choose find falling option. If you want to view the exchanger in EDR browser, so just click here. Close this one. It will show you the EDR navigation panel, so you can check the DMA input values. You can also look for the problem definition, application option, process data. You can see the exchanger geometry. In the exchanger geometry tab, this is the summary of the geometry, the tubes, the baffles, bundle layout, nozzles. You can move to the result option and in the result summary, you can find the warnings and messages associated with this exchanger. So you will adjust your geometry and the things according to the warning and messages and solve your exchanger. Thank you. If you want to learn new skills online, Join our expert lead trading courses. Visit our website www.amisalglobal.com or send your queries at admin at